February 25th, 1957, a four to six year old boy was found beaten, naked and dumped in a box on the side of Susquehanna Road in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. The body of the boy found was by a young man walking through the lot. Weirdly, this man waited a full day before telling anyone he had even found the body. Also, a second man found the body, unrelated to the first, but also didn't call police when he found him because he said he didn't want to get involved. The man who reported it was in his mid-twenties and a student at LaSalle University, a week before he decided to fuck with trappers, and he set off a couple traps in the lot where the boy was found. While he was on his way home from school, he decided to stop into the lot to check the traps to see if, like, the trappers were all pissed off and reset up their traps, but the two he set off the week before were still not set up, so whoever set the traps didn't check on them. He was walking around the lot and he noticed a box on the edge of the woods, covered by 